Some games are really strange. Take the last time game, for example. Now here's a game that can be fun, but the fun can get too serious real quick. The way the roadside guru plays it, it's like a bad acid trip. Which is odd since I've seen the people play it at parties, even kids' parties, and they have crazy fun with it. Yeah, but it's true, at those parties they never take it deep. It's the kind of game you can be as shallow or deep as you want. The rules of the game are simple. It can be played anywhere. You don't need any equipment but yourself or yourself and somebody else. Somebody goes first and they answer the question, when's the last time I... and then they fill in the blank. In a group of people, the fun begins when the other people fill in the blank for you and you have to answer. Of course, you get to decide whether or not to tell the truth. And they get to decide whether they think you're telling the truth. It can be hilarious. It can be embarrassing. It's fun to see how people react. People can be as lighthearted or mean or prying as they want. Sometimes it's a good way to find out who your friends are. But there's another way to play the game. That's when you play it by yourself. Played this way, you have to fill in the blank. You have to keep it going, keep asking the question, filling in the blank. You can't repeat yourself. And then you have to answer each question. It starts out superficial enough, but it can quickly morph into some kind of Jungian free association, active imagination trip through your soul. You'll find you're not as alone as you think you are. Different parts of you will show up. And they'll want to fill in the blank too. They might be pretty insistent. Now you may not want to hear from every part of yourself. It may turn out you may not even know some parts of yourself that show up. But the object of the game is to see how long you can keep it going, regardless where it takes you or what you discover. How many times do you want to answer that question? And if you want to stop the game, you got to ask yourself, why? When is the last time I... When's the last time I... When's the last time I played on the floor? When's the last time I got lost just to explore? When's the last time I should have taken less but I took more? When's the last time I asked someone for their autograph? When's the last time I went dancing? When's the last time I worked on a meaningful project? When's the last time I made love instead of having sex? The game could go sideways real quick. The roadside guru warned me, if I played the game long enough by myself, I will lose control of picking things to fill in that blank. Something deep inside will start filling it in for me. It may even make me wonder if it's a game at all. Fact is, I might not encounter the real game until the question gets answered. When's the last time I take a breath?